Ellie, congratulations. What was going through your mind when you guys were down 29 nothing? You know, we uh, went to the locker room at halftime, and Spencer and Coach gave us a great speech. They said, you know, we put a lot of hard work into this, and we have all our opportunities. We just need to bring it to fruition. And we uh, just kept fighting. We just kept that, that dog mentality, and we just kept going and keeping the gas pedal down, and we just never gave up, and that's, that's how it came out. We came out on top at the end of the day. How do you best describe the second half that you had individually? Yeah, you know, it's been a season of ups and downs, as everybody knows, but I just I had to lock in and I had to really think about where I want to be in the future. And I just used that as motivation to, to just put my best effort out there. But honestly, like, it's a whole team effort. Like, you need the, I need the time for the court. The O-line needs to make time for the quarterback to throw it. Quarterback needs to throw a great ball, which he was doing, and I need to catch it and score. And it just, everybody came together as a whole. It wasn't just an effort by myself. It was an effort as a whole team, really. And that's what allowed us to win. What was the spark? What was the turning point? I think I don't think there's really a spark. I think it's just you just consistently do your job over and over again. And uh, Coach Taylor always says this, if everybody does their job over and over again, you don't need a spark. You just will just keep going, and you'll slowly, slowly chip away at that lead and come back, and that's what we did. An incredible second half. I saw you sucking on oxygen, uh, a memorable, memorable performance and a big win. Congratulations. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Give something. Try to take a red so I can breathe.